yeah, gaining weight back is soul crushing. Because there you are, you're so happy, you've lost some weight, feeling great, and then all of a sudden, it's like there's a demon inside of you, and you can't stop eating. And you're like, what's the matter with me? Ah, I was on this great diet, it was such a good diet, and then here I am. Wow, something's wrong with me. My friends, there's nothing wrong with you. The paradigm you're working in doesn't work. The number one predictor of weight gain is going on a diet. And the people who go on diets and lose weight, they're all psyched and happy and they talk about it. But no one talks about it when you gain the weight back, right? So it seems like the diet works, but it's you who fails. But again, the diet is setting you up for failure because mother nature is strong. And when you torment yourself on a diet and you learn to ignore hunger, you learn to ignore satiety, you learn to eat foods you don't even like, your body goes, whoa, and sends you massive binge feelings when you finally let go of that diet. And the people who lose weight on a diet and keep the weight off, those few people, they're still dieting. And that's not a good enough life for you. And it wasn't a good enough life for me. I was a dieter from the ages of 15 to 40, 25 years. I know that diet mentality brain of yours very well. And thankfully in the year 2000, when I turned 40, I said, I can't do this anymore. And I stopped dieting. And the beautiful irony is that when you stop dieting, everything changes and you go back to the person you were always meant to be. The person who knew when they were hungry, who knew what food they liked, who didn't alternately starve and then stuff themselves because that's what dieting teaches you to do. I've helped people in six continents leave diet culture behind and embrace intuitive eating. Now you may have some thoughts about intuitive eating, you may not know what it is, but let me show you the way that intuitive eating works, not only for a happy, stress-free relationship with food and eating, but for weight loss. And I get flack from people saying intuitive eating isn't for weight loss. Yes, it is. When you match eating with hunger and you understand the beauty of waiting for hunger in order to eat, you end up eating less. It's perfect for weight loss. And when you lose weight with intuitive eating, it's gone for good because you haven't traumatized your body. You've gently guided yourself to eating a little bit less. If this sounds at all appealing to you, stick around, check out our website. We've got tons of blogs. I'm on all the platforms with long form and all that. Let me show you how to do this. It'll be the best gift you ever give your, gave yourself finally to get and stay at your happy weight the way mother nature intended.